was day 11! And here is the Christmas tree in the sunroom in the light of day. It still needs to be cleaned up, cleaned up underneath and there's still some leaves inside in it. Um, but it looks really nice. It's so full at the top. And oh, it's just a really nice looking tree. And then dad hung the baubles today. He hung the three. And then Jared hung the rest of them because dad, you know, on the ladder. He just felt a bit wobbly, so Jared said he'd do it for him. Now, I'm gonna go get changed because I'm wearing a Ravenclaw t-shirt and a pair of tracksuit bottoms and a pink thing. And we're gonna go to Waterford. We're gonna go to Waterford and then later on when I come home, I'll decorate the tree. Let's update the board. This is like ASMR. There are only 14 more days till Christmas. Mana, mana. It was chilly last night, so I put an extra blanket on my bed. And Eilie was playing underneath it as I was, you know, billowing it out to put it on the bed. So I put my hand underneath the blanket and I pulled her out and she started meowing at me. I, I, like, as soon as my hands hit her, she went, Meow. and I was like, aw. That's sad, I've never heard a meow like that before. You know, when I was bringing it. What? The What's going on? What are you doing? Hi, what? Ow, 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 you're closing my neck. Ow. My lighting situation for the white tree is that obviously, obviously the lights that I put on the middle part, I can't use as I mentioned in my last vlog. So I have a set of lights in my Amazon basket and they're 27 euros. If I buy them, they'll be delivered by Wednesday. Uh, so I'm thinking of buying them. Your claw, Eilie, okay. And then I'd have 30 meters. I currently only have five. So it does mean I'd have a lot more light. So I might buy them. And then I'm also looking at, however, the IR relay. Last night I went out and the little sensor part that I was looking for was on the ground um, outside my bedroom door on the mat. I don't know how it got there. It's almost like somebody was playing with it. Uh, were you playing with it? Headbutt me if you were playing with it. Oh, there you go! You just like it would be handy if I got them though, because it's 30 meters of lights all together on two separate lengths. So there's 15 meters per length, and they come with a remote control, obviously. But there's also an app I can download on my phone, and they work via Bluetooth. So. That is an option because then you can go into the Bluetooth and change the color that way. And also on the app you can set timers and stuff like that. So it's something that I'm looking at, um, very much looking at. I found my polo neck, that's really nice. So I'm gonna wear this with, I have a gray hat that I made a couple of years ago with a pom pom on top. And I have a pair of jeans and now I'll just wear runners. I just need to pick which jacket to wear with it. And then we're ready to go. I'll probably wear my hair down. I'll brush it, obviously. And I'll just give my teeth a quick brush, my face a quick wash. And then we'll be ready to go. We're in Waterford and we're just looking at the lights up on the street. Aren't they lovely the way they're, it's almost like a ceiling of lights. Behind us, this lorry is all lit up and he's been beeping away and he's all lit up for the river rescue. It's deadly. And we also saw, a, there he is. Beeping again. There's some nice lights there outside the museum treasury and down the street. There they are without a reflection from the car. Aren't they nice? The lorry is a few cars back now, but we can see the lovely Ferris wheel. And if we turn back, can we get the the lorry. No, he's too far back and there's too many lights off other cars. But isn't the Ferris wheel nice? Festive! Daddy, you're on a green light. <laughs> Festive! Oh, I missed the street with the hurdy-gurdy. And there's all the ice skating. They have like games 
it is. It's like a phone fair there now. Ruby, do you want your advent calendar? Do you want your advent calendar? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, what day is it? Day 11. Now, where is day 11? Day 11. Day, day 11. It's up at the top in the corner. Okay. Ooh. Ooh, it's a meatball. Ooh, a meatball with turkey, Ruby. A meatball with turkey. Do you want it? Sit. Now, Ruby, give me the paw. Give me the paw. Good girl. Now, don't snap. Good girl. Is that yummy? I went to Waterford with mum and dad. It was very exciting. We went to Tesco. I bought some deodorant. I know. And I bought some noodles. I know. How exciting. And actually, I also bought a bottle of Pepsi Max. The excitement doesn't stop there. We went to Mr. Price and I bought some animal bars and some double-sided sticky tape and a present for somebody. So yeah, it was a super exciting day. We also went to Smith's and Kenny and Donald, but I didn't buy anything there. Um, and then me and mom went out to Aldi. And when I was in Aldi, I got these cute tissue. Look at the, look at the box, isn't that cute? So yeah, so they'd be nice and festive on my bedside locker or on my table or something. Tissues! They've got a design on them! Oh my goodness! They've got candy canes! Oh, they're cute! And then something really embarrassing happened while we were in Aldi. So, um, something fell on the ground. Actually, I don't even think it was something that we were looking at. I think there was just something on the ground and I went down to pick it up to put it back on the display. And as I bent down, I heard tearing sound. And, uh, the thigh of my jeans went crack, and now there's a big hole in my jeans. So I guess that's the end of these jeans. It's just gone nine o'clock. We were kind of late coming home from Watford. So what happened was we obviously got stuck on the quay in traffic. It was crazy. And um, after dinner, me and dad decided we're not going to decorate the tree tonight. We're, we're going to put up the lights, so he's going to attach the lights one set at a time to the, to the top of the tree and then I'll lay them out and then after they're all laid out we will leave it overnight and I'll just put the baubles on tomorrow before work. We just need to adjust it slightly but the lights are on. The Christmas tree, oh Christmas tree, oh Christmas tree. That was an ordeal. It took like two hours to get the lights on the tree because the we put on the white ones which we know there's a loose wire down near the connection box where you can change the settings for the flashing or steady or whatever. But it's fine, we've known that that's like that for years. The red ones are fine. The blue ones just stopped working. Plugged them in, nothing. Tried a different transformer, nothing. So dad had to take them apart and fix them. But we got them fixed and now they are working as you saw on the tree. What is us with broken lights this year? Um, the lights on the tree on the landing, also broken. Yeah, great, wonderful. I did however buy a replacement set of those today. They should be here this week, Wednesday or Thursday. And my friend Chloe, hey Chloe. Chloe actually sent me a link to another set of lights. And she was like, I don't know which ones are broken, but these ones are really good. We got them for someone and they love them. Um, I think she said her grandmother got them and loved them. So I was like, I mean, who doesn't love that enough? A nice spare set of lights. That is it for Vlogmas Day 11. If you like this vlog, please give it a thumbs up, maybe share it. Subscribe if you want to see more of my face. And if you want to follow me on Instagram or Twitter, my details are in the doobly-doo down below. Thank you for watching. TTFN.